has been training. She did a puppy class with us, Family Dog One, Family Dog Two, and she's also trained in tribal. Zooty's done all, about the same number of classes with us. He's done agility. Um, um, he's also on the freestyle team with the Santa Cruz Dog Training Club. So, got some nice cantering out to the mat. Isn't that great? Let's give JoJo a hand and Judy a hand. Hmm. The next thing that we're going to demonstrate is how we teach the dogs to bring the balls to us. So we're going to teach, show how we teach orientation with the ball. Oh. Well, Monica spent so much time training that mat that the dog just goes right to it. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to send your dog to their bed that way? Where they just love going there so much? And it's all done with the same behaviors that we train in tri-ball. So we do not really start with balls when we're training because a lot of times the dogs get so excited by balls that all they want to do is push them to the point where they burst them. So we train a lot of other things first before we actually get to the balls. We do this behavior. You can see how well aware the dogs are of their rear ends. They're just adjusting their rear end. You see how nicely she's stepped into place there. Good job. Let's do a round of applause for Jojo. Okay, so the next behavior that we're going to show you is how we train pushing the ball. Just the fact that these that Monica and Judy work with their dogs so much makes the dogs a lot easier to live with. They're training any kinds of tricks, games. Yay, nice little push on that ball. Isn't that cool? It's like billiards. Billiards with your dog. And we call this urban herding. You don't need sheep. Monica's going to start back by the bowl and send the dog out around the ball. Jojo. Nice. Nice that one. She's rewarding her for staying in position. Gives the bat a little bit more value. I'm just going to send her out from the other side. So she doesn't just only send one side. Nice Just a couple of weeks ago, Jojo would only walk out to the ball. And now she's getting a lot more excited about going to the mat. You see a nice little canter as she runs out. So it's how much joy these dogs have for working. And look at the focus these dogs have. Monica spent a lot of time building focus, as has Judy. on the ball, we want her to listen to her handler. So Jojo loves that ball so much that we've had to do a lot of remedial work on getting her to be able to walk, run past it, to be called past it. So that's pretty exceptional for this young dog. 
Very nice. Great head position, nice speed, nice work, Monica and Jojo. Let's give Judy and Zuni, Monica and Jojo, a very big round of applause for doing a great demo for us.